Hello people, welcome to this tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn about arithmetic circuit. circuit. First is half header. So I draw here the block diagram of half header. It is very easy. Nothing is complicated. It has two inputs and two outputs. Let's assume two inputs are A and B and two outputs are first is sum and second is carry. This is sum and this one is carry so this is half adder so as simple as that this is the basic block diagram of the half adder so now i draw the <coughs> truth table of the half adder truth table so we can draw from the this basic diagram it has two inputs so for inputs uh, a and b and outputs sum and carry so two inputs means we will have four rows sorry for bad handwriting okay so uh, for <coughs> four rows means zero 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 one one zero one one so we have to uh, do arithmetic of the sum only like we do in binary addition so zero plus zero zero and sum is zero carry is also zero zero plus one sum is one and carry is also no carry is zero haha <laughs> uh, one plus zero sum is one carry is zero but here one plus one sum is zero and carry is one so this is as simple as that uh, this is very easy you know if you you will get this if you know binary addition so this is zero zero one uh, in decimal number these are the binary number this is one one zero means two and one one means three so this is block diagram of half header let's write here we are discussing about half adder it is arithmetical circuit which is used to add uh, which is used uh, in a <coughs> addition in a circuits and this is truth table of half adder so from this truth table let's make a k map for the sum and carry so we have we we have two outputs sum and carry so we have to make two K maps. So let's make first K map for sum. We have two inputs A and B. So A bar A and B bar B. So 0, 1, 2, 3. 0, 1, 2, 3. This is for sum. K map, K map for sum. So in so let's go to the truth table. In sum, we have one in only one and two. We have one. We have act, uh, let's simplify. Zero means not active. One means active. We have active stage of uh, outputs in on in only one and two. So I will denote 1 in only 1 and 2 means 1 and 2 only 1 and 2 will be 1 and others are 0 they are 0 so here group group of 1 1 and this one so the arithmetical expression for the uh, sum uh, for the sum of the half header will be this one and this one so for this one the expression will be a a b bar sum x is equal to a b bar plus this one this one means a bar b a bar b this is a b bar and this one is a bar b so the expression for the sum of half header is a b bar plus a bar b this is nothing but the expression of x nor gate which which we denote as in this format 
so later this is useful to draw a circuit diagram of a half header so let's uh, see the um, k map for carry this is very simple because we have only one uh, output stage active let's hear this for carry there is only one in the last stage means three means for three only there is one active other will be zero a b a bar a b bar b only one so the equation for this is a b so carry is equal to a b so we got two expressions for s and c from this two expression let's um, let's design a circuit diagram for half half header so i design i don't have pages pages are in my cupboard so i design behind of this page this was the project of my college but my printer was off so half of the printer so i am using this here okay hope you understand so the circuit diagram for s and c so we have to how to draw circuit diagram you know this uh, we have two inputs a and b so first we have to draw this a bar plus a b a bar b and for c a b bar but instead of uh, array, sorry we have to show this a bar plus a bar b and c equal to ab but instead of uh, showing this whole equation in in circuit diagram we can directly show this equation to reduce the form of the circuit diagram by showing directly x or gate so we will put ab into x or gate like this which directly give us the output is equal to s this output and for uh, c we we have to perform this operation c is equal to ab so perform this here we get our c is equal to ab this is the block circuit diagram of uh, circuit diagram of half header so if you find this complicated let's i make this easy if you want to make a circuit diagram of half header using basic gates let's do that let's first uh, make a test to let's first make a bar, b bar plus a bar b a and b first i have to a b bar i have to obtain a b bar so this is a and this is b bar this is one uh, i found here a b bar a b bar i obtain a b bar a b bar here and now i have to obtain a bar b so this is a bar and this is and this is b as you show no this is b so i obtain here a bar b and i have to uh, perform both a b bar and a bar b addition this gate so i apply this gate which will give my me design output a b bar plus a bar b and for the this is output of sum and for the output for output of the carry uh, we will simply perform like this in the la last circuit we have designed for c we have to obtain a b so let's simply get a and this is b b apply get this is our output c is equal to ab so this is the basic of half header let's repeat this is the uh, <clears throat> basic block diagram of half header two inputs two outputs sum and carry truth table two inputs two outputs 
sum is active in only two state carries uh, of output carries active only one state of, of output from this we can draw truth table from truth table we have obtained a logic array ex boolean expression of them this boolean equation is uh, similar to x x or gate from this x or gate we can easily draw this circuit if we we can't easily determine this circuit we can use basic uh, gates and draw this circuit thank you for watching but the uh, <coughs> disadvantage of half adder is we can't add the pre uh, carry of the previous addition in input because as we know half adder half adder has only two inputs we can't uh, add additional input as a uh, in output of the previous expression as we f if we already have here performed addition or subtraction any we have carry and this carry we have to apply in next operation we can't do this in the half adder this is the disadvantage of half adder we can overcome overcome of from this uh, disadvantage by using full adder that we will discuss in next tutorial thank you for watching this tutorial